It's a 61 Pontiac, has a 409 Chevrolet engine in, which is pretty unusual. I keep pe having people say, why would you put a Chevrolet engine in a Pontiac? Well, the fact is, uh, this Pontiac was born with a Chevrolet engine in because it's from Canada, where I'm from. So all Pontiacs of that era had Chevrolet uh, drivetrains in them. In fact, they had the X-frame. It's basically, it, it's a Chevrolet with Pontiac, Pontiac sheet metal. They came off the same assembly line as, as the Chevrolets did in Oshawa, Ontario, Canada. This particular car was born with a six-cylinder Chevrolet engine in it, uh, or you could get a 283 or a 348, which was the W motor. And by 62, 63, 64, uh, then you could get the 409. But this is a 409, but it's uh, it's stroked out to 509 cubic inches, and uh, it dynoed at 866 horsepower. It's uh, it's it's run a best time of 906. Uh, so it's it's pretty good for a big car. We built this car. Well, uh, I would say I think it's about six years ago now, and um, uh, we bought it in Winnipeg, uh, like about the center of Canada. It's just kind of north of Chicago and drove it to Toronto and then when we got it there we uh, took it all apart and turned it into a race car. It was a fairly rusty car at the time when, when we got it, you know, it was actually it was painted with a brush. Yeah, <laughs> uh -oh. yeah, it's, you know, you can imagine, but we did drive it, it drove all the way, you know, a 1300 mile drive and it, uh, and it, and it made it without, uh, without any issues, it made it all the way home, so uh, uh, it was pretty good. Uh, myself and the other fellow here, we, we, we own a small trucking company, so by the end of the week we would have some time off. We were always restoring old cars, like, uh, uh, you know, just, just driver cars, like what you'd see over in the parking lot over there. And uh, uh, maybe not quite to the level of some of those, they're awfully nice, but uh, we, we would fix up hot rods. And then, of course, uh, uh, he got a, a 62 Impala with a 409. and. Uh, uh, it went pretty good. We stroked out the engine, made about 550 horsepower, and so uh, it went really good. So we thought, well, we got to take that to the track and find out what it'll do. And of course, we went to the track, and it was like, to me, I, I'm way more interested in this, uh, you, you know, where you've got all the, um, the drag cars. It's like being at a car show, only it's interesting cars that actually uh, perform. So, so we, you know, rather than Nothing against the car shows, we kind of liked it too, but, but you know, we used to go to the car shows and you'd stand around and once you walked around and looked at all the cars, then it's like, what else is there to do, you know? Yeah. 